All right, tonight I'm making spaghetti avoncola. It's a bit of garlic, parsley, and uh, chili pepper. Spaghetti are cooking. Here are the avoncola, clams. I boil them two minutes with a bit of oil and white wine and parsley in a pot, this pot. And this is all the liquid, all oh, the clams that was then collected. Mm. Okay, now the, the garlic, it's cooked. We add the clam juice to let it warm again. If you like, you can add a few cherry tomatoes. I like my spaghetti longer than white. The pasta is cooking. Spaghetti cooking time is 10 minutes. I cook them for seven and then I will finish them into the sauce. And I will add the vongole just at the end because the vongole don't need to cook too much. Good level of fire. So I put a bit too much chili pepper because I like it that way, but you don't need so much. Okay, for most of the pastas, <clears throat> what is important is to always collect uh, some, oh, it's a bit hot, collect some uh, water. The water, not any water, but the water where the pasta is cooked. See, it's very, it's not transparent at all because it's rich of the amides of the pasta, okay? What you do is once you start uh, stirring the pasta and the sauce, if it's too dry, then you add a bit of the cooking water. Okay, so I just added the pasta. I will add all the clams. Hint, clean. After you boil the clams for two minutes, let them rest for a few minutes before you remove the shells. You can keep some shells for decoration. I found it absolutely stupid. I mean, you always get a piece of a shell and you break your teeth. Why would you do this? This phase of cooking the pasta is the most critical. This is when you have to stir quickly so that the sauce links with the pasta. You can add some more fresh parsley if you wish. I don't because I already had two layers. I still taste a bit of the grain. And I don't need the extra water. It's already moist as it is. The pasta should never be dry. So you can see here. You see the sweat of the sauce. Because it's almost finished, I don't need to add more, otherwise I would have added. As I told you, I put a bit too much chili pepper, because I wanted to feel the spice. seconds also if you have an electric stove you can just do, do this yeah I still need to improve my skills and that's it Impiattiamo. Ed eccolo qua, il nostro spaghettino a vongole. Buon appetito, a vostro.